saw the first call out come out and beat Dallas McCarver, who you battled with last week, didn't make it through the first pose. Did you catch that? I, I wouldn't count poses, but when I saw a guy move towards him and shift, I was like, oh, wow, he's going down. So I, I immediately took him in that direction because that's a big guy. Yeah. I, I hate to see him at the stage right out. So, what do you think was going on? Was it dehydration? Or what went through your mind when you saw the big country kind of walk, waffling back and forth? It looked like he was going to faint. You know, you know it, was, it was kind of a concern for me when you know, I found out he was going off these shows. Uh, you know, having a, a big body like that, it's uh, you know, traveling all over the world, it's, it's, it's a little tough, especially when uh, you know, you're doing the dehydration process over and over again, back to back. So I'm sure it's, maybe his electrolytes are off, way off. Uh, I mean, I don't know if he, he severely hydrated, dehydrated, literally, more of you know, his electrolytes being off. You know, because I think that's where the breathing comes in and can't catch your breath. He looked like he was breathing hard backstage before we went out there, talked to him very briefly, and then, of course, the bright lights hit you, the anxiety comes on, and then the pressure of having to perform. All of those things happen. So then he's gone. And, and did you actually get compared at all? Did you even pose? Uh, yeah, I posed uh, one, the, one the first call when I got it right. I posed that one, and then I didn't pose again. So, uh, you know, not, not a lot of work. But I'm thinking it's a balance, a, a mix of blood pressure, which was too low. Maybe his blood should have dropped as well. It's just a combination hit the floor. Yeah. Well